Hello everyone, how are you? I'll be reviewing the vacuum food sealer which I recently got from Amazon. So just want to share with you, you know, how to um, use it. So let's start with it. Um, so this is the brand Nana Home and it's used to vacuum the vacuum seal the food so that you know it can marinate uh, pretty quickly and um, especially for us we indians uh, we do eat a lot of marinated foods and if you don't use this it usually takes like uh, eight hours or ten hours to marinate something but with the vacuum seal marinating you know it usually takes a couple of hours to marinate it makes everything pretty easy and uh, so you know First thing first, you have to go through the manual. It uh, it have all the instruc instructions in here. Um, so that's the basic idea. Uh, you know how to seal, how to vacuum, and all those things. So the package includes a user manual, a vacuum tube. Uh, this is used to basically you know suck out air uh, out of uh, basically containers um, like Tupperwares and all those things. It includes 10 vacuum bags in there, uh, but if you want more, you need to add, order them separately. Uh, this same brand, Nana Home, uh, sell bags to, uh, I think for two rolls, it's like $20 on Amazon. Um, that's about it. And the actual machine, uh, it's pretty light. It's made of plastic. The actual body is made of plastic. It's pretty light. Uh, very easy to carry. Uh, so let's let's start with. So I got some veggies marinated in this bag. You know, I basically use the simple simple ingredients like bitter gourd, um, some chili, uh, salt, and some oil. So I'm gonna you know vacuum seal this, marinate this, and I will show you how to use the machine. So first of all, you know the wire. You need to plug it in and hit the on and off button. So once it turns on, you know, the blue light is on right now and you open the machine. So there are two, two buttons on each side. You press them and you flip the cover. So it comes off like this. So it, the machine opens. And once you do that, you have to put your vacuum bag in there. Let me move the machine a little to the corner and put the bag so let me show you this so the bag has two sides one is all textured and the other is the smooth side so this textured side needs to go on the on the silicon here so that you know it doesn't move so you put the bag in there and you make sure like it it fits and everything make sure it's all lined up and then close this so now it's all set up to do the vacuum seal so now it has a couple of options in here uh, it can only do vacuum uh, there is option to just seal uh, it seals the bag and the other option is the vacuum seal and the vacuum seal also have two options in there so one is just regular vacuum seal so basically it, it sucks out the air and it seals it uh, but there is one more option called wet seal so it sucks out the air then it's it uh, basically you know double seals it so some so suppose if you have wet marinade in here uh, like oil or you know something wet uh, so that it, it seals it double like two times so that you know the marinade doesn't get out so for that you have to press uh, the vacuum seal button two times okay it's running so let's see what it does It's taking its time. So in the meantime, I can go through the manual, you know, just to make sure I did everything right. One more time. Okay, maybe I didn't put it correctly. Let, let me try it one more time. Uh, 
or maybe it takes some time so let's see let's try it for a couple of minutes okay yeah there there are some grooves which the bag needs to go in there i think so yeah okay so let me try it now there you go i got it you know this <laughs> you have to try it a couple of times it's, it's my first time too so but i figured it out and it's pretty easy okay take it out it switch off by itself and okay so if you see let me put this real close and it's sealed right here so now you can either cut off this top part or either just just put in the fridge and this usually redu reduces the marinade time it, it only a couple of hours this should be ready to ready to cook okay so that was about it that was a, my review if you like it you know hit subscribe and you know you can follow me i will i'll be uploading the reviews for a lot of products okay then thank you